Greetings from True Life Community, Seventh-day Adventist Church. This is Pastor Bob Reynolds with a, another devotional for today. I heard about a man, and, and I'm not a green thumb myself. I, you know, I grow a garden. I like tomatoes and we grow flowers and stuff like that. But I'm not really a green thumb because sometimes those things die. Some of them die from whatever. Lack of water or not paying attention to them. I heard of one man who <clears throat> planted some flowers and they were perennials, but he didn't know what perennials were. And he had these beautiful flowers that decorated his yard, his garden. And one day <clears throat> they started turning brown and wilting and he was, he was discouraged with them. And he, just in time, a neighbor came by and said, no, 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 don't pull those out of the ground and throw them away. He said, those are perennials, there's a bulb underground and if you leave that there, when the season gets warm again, they're going to come back. They die during the winter, but they come back when the season gets warm again. <laughs> and so this man left them in the ground, and sure enough, they came back again the next season. You know, it kind of reminds us of Jesus. He was put in the ground. He was buried. He died, and he was buried but then he came back again and he promised that he's going to come back from heaven to take all of the people who have passed away and those who are living, who have believed in him and have turned their lives over to him and have obeyed him. He's going to take them to heaven and then they will inherit the earth made new. We will live with him forever. So he's going to resurrect us if we die before he comes when we believe in him and we trust in him. <laughs> There's a story in the Bible about a man by the name of Lazarus. And Lazarus had died. He was a friend of Jesus when Jesus was here. And, and Martha was a sister to Lazarus. And when Jesus came back into town where Lazarus had died, Martha said to him, if you had been here, he wouldn't have died. And then Jesus answered her with these words. Listen to this. This is in John chapter 11. And verse 25, Jesus says, I am the resurrection and the life. He who believes in me, though he may die, he shall live. <laughs> Jesus is promising, even though we die, he's going to resurrect us when the season comes, when he comes to take us home. Let's pray that we'll be ready for that, shall we? Father, as we bow in again in your presence today, I ask that you would just give us hearts to be like yours. Help us to be ready and willing and able to, to tell others about your love for them and so that they will be ready and we will be ready to be resurrected if we die before you come. I thank you for the privilege that we have of living again forever. In Jesus' name, amen. 